Girl, you can tell that I cut this. What is what is this, honey? Ladies and gentlemen and everybody in between, I'm back with somebody else's hair and guess what? It is wine and wig stay. Clink, 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 clink. We're showing up with big juicy curls, a big red lip for the holidays, and a big glass of green tea. My, li my lips are getting dry though. This red lip is really trying it. I just need a little bit of Orlando Sun and a brand new wig just to give me that little oomph that I was looking for, but look at this hair. I, v part wigs are stepping into the room and taking the gruv men. She's stepping into the room and collecting checks. But what V part though? It's just looking like I just grew out my hair. It looks like I just used a little soul for A, giving very much 2007 YouTube. Like, tell me what you're drinking down below. I'm gonna say thank you. Thank you for subscribing. While I was like out of town, we hit 50,000 subscribers and I'm living my, I'm not even gonna cry. I'm not crying, you're crying. I'm living my dreams at the age of 34 and I don't know how to thank y'all. I can't thank y'all enough. So if you would like, you know, I'm still gonna ask y'all to click the subscribe button because I'm just gonna. But just thank you for being here. So, <laughs> let's go ahead and get into this wig. I'm so excited. So, so I want to say thank you to Beauty Forever for providing this gorgeous V-part wig to me and sponsoring this video. We don't have no lace on here. There's minimal leave out, no edges out. Girl, we are living our lives with minimal stress. Let me go ahead and give y'all the details on this wig. So this wig is the Kinky Curly V Part Wig from Beauty Forever. It was 24 inches long when I originally got it. Y'all know I'm Eliana Scissorhands. I'm going to cut it. So she has been cut and shaped, but it was 24 inches when I received the wig and it is 150% density. When you pop the hood on this wig and when you look inside of the cap, it is a V-part wig and around the V-part you have four combs and then you have an extra comb in the middle for security and those are all snap-in combs. There are five snap-in combs, four around the V-part perimeter and one in the center and there are three combs around the perimeter of the head. So there are eight combs inside the cap of this wig so she's fully secure. So with this wig, the cap construction allows for you to you can do no leave out or minimal leave out i chose minimal leave out a little bit in the part and um none around the edges bro it looks like finger waves like what is going on it's giving low tide <laughs> when i first received this wig i received it in a beautiful beauty forever box they have their little christmasy boxes that's another wig that's gonna go under the tree and of course they provided us with gifts um, I received the light skin wig cap, um, a satin bandana, some lashes, and hair clips. I also received a cute thank you card and a cute little sock. Like, not a sock, what do you call it? A Christmas stocking, perfect for Christmas as well and for the holidays. The wig came in this, like the machine curled curly texture. It didn't look quite like this, it looked more like it looked more machine curled, gorgeous. So I'm gonna show you everything I did to get this look. I'm gonna show you how it looks with no leave out and with leave out like this. So I showed you both no leave out and leave out for a side part with fine hair. So if you have thin hair like me, this will be good for you to see so you can make a good educated decision. If y'all wanna see everything I did to get this gorgeous curly, Super girl, you can tell that I cut this. What is what is this, honey? But if you want to see everything I did to get this wig look, please keep on watching and then I'll be back at the very end with a coupon code. Let's go ahead and pop my hair out. Now, y'all know I forever got a snowbank on my head. 
I need to invest in some head and shoulders or head and shoulders needs to invest in me. Doesn't matter because we're about to just braid this hair down. So let me show you the V part wig. I'm all over the place. So this is the wig after she has been washed. Look at her. It still feels a little bit dry. So we definitely need to add some moisturization. I was thinking about doing a side part. Oh, I really want to do a side part, but um, the dandruff is too bad <laughs> in this area. Maybe I just need to put a little moisturization on me. Do y'all care that I got dandruff? Can y'all tell? Y'all don't care. Do y'all care? Y'all don't care. Now I'm gonna need y'all to give me grace. I want to see how this wig is going to fare without any hair left out. We're gonna see what it looks like. We like to give the girls a chance. I'm just gonna do a light braid down and we're gonna try to see what it looks like without any hair left out. We're curious and I just wanna try it on. So I'm just gonna braid it down. my little broken off piece oh it's not that bad i cut that oh yay so my hair is braided down and i want to see how this side part looks this is the side part it's on this side okay because i've done middle parts before let's do a side part so this is the v part like i've told you in the beginning it has five combs around the v and then three in the back and it also has adjustable straps so th this thing is a contraption honey Okay, we're gonna do it like right here. Ooh, okay. I like to clip almost on the part. So I'm gonna clip right here. Clip right there. Oh, oh, ow, ow. Oh, I did too much. You know how you over clip? I'm over clipped. Okay, girl, relax. There we go. Yo. That's not too shabby. Hold on. Oh, this needs to back up a bit. Oh, Ooh, this is what the hair looked like, though. Okay, hair looks super pretty, but the side part, it doesn't quite work for me, but the hair, I don't like the side part without any hair left out. Oh, let me pull the wig down. That's why it's crooked. Ooh, ow. The way my hair is set up, mm, we need to leave a little bit of hair out. So that's what we're going to be doing. But first, before we get into that, I'm gonna go ahead and trim this hair. So I think it'd be best to style it now. Where my scissors at? Where my scissors? So what I would like to do is give bangs, right? And layering. I'm a little bit nervous. Y'all know how I get because y'all know I can't cut hair. We got to be careful, but we're going to try today. None of my hair is left out, so I ain't gotta worry about messing up my hair. So, so let's go ahead and cut. I'm gonna take this bang part. This is the bang, and I wanna cut it down to like a short something something. So we're just gonna cut at an angle. And y'all know, I if I don't just get it right into it, I ain't gonna do it. That rhymed a little bit. Yes, it's already looking good. You looking good, sis? Okay, so I'm gonna go back in with this front part. I feel like I'm gonna go a tad bit shorter. For this side, I just wanna angle it down like that and for this part out here, in order to get the most out of this fluff, I'm just gonna cut off a little bit off the bottom. Y'all know how I cut off the bottom, right? <laughs> the girls, no, I can't cut. You sit in my salon chair, girl, you gotta sign a waiver. No, ma'am, I don't know what I'm doing. So <clears throat> on the bottom, just to cut it a little bit more even, 
It's going to take it and cut just like this. Ooh, that's so much better. Yes, yes, yes. And for this part right here, I'm just going to cut into it. So we're going to take a section and I'm just going to cut into it just a little bit. Now, I, this part, I, I've never done it like this before, so. There we go. Did I already? What section did I just do? Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. <laughs> what did I just do? Oh, God. Girl, pray for me. Disclaimer, you follow what I'm doing, you may just ruin your way. Y'all see that? This shaping was just done by eye. And I think we did a good job. I just look at it from up front and then just pull out the pieces that look like it's a little bit too long and cut them down. Oh my God, that's so pretty. <gasps> it may not be like perfectly layered. Hairstylists don't come for me. Now that the cut is done, it's not perfect. I am not a hairstylist, so this is not going to be a perfect haircut. Ooh, cut this part. I want it a little bit shorter, so we're just gonna take the hair like that, just so I can have like a little bit more of like a bang. I want to be able to kind of see like if the hair flipped in front of my face. That's all. Ooh, this is a winner, chicken dinner. Ooh, this hair is huge. Ooh, it looks so good. It's so big. That's what she said. Oh my God, it's so big. I feel like I need to define these curls and I would like to define these curls right now um, before I pull out my leave out because it starts to shift the wig when you start styling it while your leave out is there. Plus the hair is a little bit dry and I need her to have some moisturization on this situation. So, so here is the mousse. It is the Shea Moisture Frizz Free Curl Mousse. I use this for my curly hair. I'm gonna take some mousse. I don't know if I wanna do big sections or small. I kinda wanna do uh, just the whole thing. I just don't feel like I say this every time. Thinking about working in sections, I just don't feel like waiting for it to dry. I gotta be honest with y'all. I'm trying to see if I can clump these ends up a bit. There we go. That's what I was looking for. I need my ends to do that. I'll do like three sections. Y'all know I always be saying, I ain't gonna section it. And then I section it, girl, I'm just late. <laughs> that track is giving me the business, ain't she? Yes, ma'am, she is. We're just gonna add the mousse. Oh, that's the, cur that's it. <gasps> Y'all see? Ah, that's what I was looking for. That's what I needed. Do this section and let's just go all the way across the head. We'll make this really, really quick so we can get into adding our natural hair.
Okay, so this hair is, I would say it's about 60% dry. We need to prep our leave out, a very minimal leave out. So I'm gonna pop this off. Ooh, this thing has been jerked around on my head. <laughs> I'm gonna pop this off and we're gonna start prepping our actual leave out. Oh, 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 there we go. Ooh, and we're gonna let this hair just dry. She's gonna dry while we prep the leave out that we have. So start with one side, but we're gonna do very thin hair. Um, <laughs> girl, the hair is fine in T ways. So I'm going to do very, very thin leave out okay so this is the leave out that we have here i'm just gonna separate it right i don't even think my part goes back that far but okay this is the leave out for that side so i'm just gonna rebraid the hair down as you can see like right here my hair is so thin like it's see through you hear me so i'm just gonna pin it right here and then braid the rest of this hair down And I'm gonna do the other side and part out the hair and braid it down. This is how thin this part is going to be. So I've added the other side. This is what our part is looking like. Super thin, super duper thin. So we're gonna twist these two parts together. Okay, so we're just gonna braid down this side. Okay, so let's go ahead and apply our wig. Like this is how much leave out we have, sis. Hold on, I'm gonna turn to the side. Can you see my blinds through that? <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and throw back on the wig. So I'm gonna start in the front this time. And then anchor the clip. Ooh, that looks good. Then back here. Then... Right there, and then the front. Oh, how is this working? Like that, and clip it. I need to go a little bit closer. There we go. Ooh, that is close. As you can see, it is really close to my parts. It looks so good. Okay, I'm gonna take my little twisty down. Now that that's done, all I have to do is blend my hair. And I feel like all I need is a little mousse. Now my hair is much curlier and coilier than this, but we're gonna use our Shea Moisture, our Shea Moisture, moist, Moisture, <laughs> our Shea Moisture Frizz Free Curl Mousse once again. And I'm just gonna add it to my hair. Where's the hair at, girl? I'm just gonna add it to this side as well. Is it covered? I need to let the roots dry. So while the roots are drying, I'm gonna take a baby hair brush and we're gonna do like a couple of baby hairs. So I'm going to use the Eco Styler olive oil gel and I'm just gonna take my baby hair brush and we're going to do baby hairs. Now I have to be careful right here because this hair is really puffy and short. So I'm not gonna do nothing to that hair because that's what's covering up the um, tracks over there. So we're gonna do baby hairs right below it. <laughs> do I look a fool? A little bit. Sometimes baby hairs just ain't got no place at the party. But I'ma do it. Gonna add some in our usual places. Thank you. 
Y'all, <laughs> this is not a drill. This is not a gel grow. This is, I don't know what to tell y'all. Except I'm cute as hell. This, I, I done ate it up. This is giving my hair plus some. And I was really, really afraid of the side part situation. But the curls, the minimal leave out. I mean, we have no leave out on the edges because I don't like to fight with my edges. They are gonna win every single time. The cut, the side part, the moment. I'm gonna fluff her up just a little bit more cause y'all know, y'all know how I like my hair. Say it with me, big and igni, in your face, in my face, in my eyeball. Yes ma'am. It looks so beautiful. Let me show y'all the back. Let me spin around in my new chair. Uh oh. Oh girl. Now y'all know I cut this myself, so it may not look right. Yes. Oh, how do I turn back around, girl? And as far as my roots with this V part, like you cannot, I, y'all tell me where y'all find the tracks. Now you can see back here, that is the mesh, but girl, I can put a little concealer on that to make it look like a part or I can just leave it alone. But I could cut it back a little bit further, but I'm not doing that. And you can't tell where the hair starts. I will tell you that my hair is particularly thin in this area. You saw it. It's breaking a lot. It's dry, girl. I don't know what's going on in the area. Sis needs some Rogaine. But either way, I was able to wear this side part with no issues, no problems. I'm in love with this hair. I have to say that this hair is like top. It's top notch hair. It is top 10. Thank you to Beauty Forever, my girlies over at Beauty Forever for providing this wig to me and sponsoring this video. If you are interested in this hair, of course, Beauty Forever has given me a coupon code. So you can get $10 off your purchase of this wig from Beauty Forever. The coupon code is BEAUTYTB. That is BEAUTYTB for $10 off. Y'all tell me what you think down below. Thank y'all so much for watching. Thank you for 50,000 subscribers. I cannot thank y'all enough. I love y'all. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Oh, my ring. Let's do that again. Bye.